Hello everyone, this is Dr. Nikita Reddy, Consultant Obstetrician and Gynecologist, Kim Scuddles Hospitals, Gachibali. So today we are here to talk about food habits in pregnancy. I am sure a lot of mothers are confused with the overwhelming advice happening in pregnancy and it is very difficult to navigate what to eat and what not to eat. So let's break the myths one by one. Now should you be eating for two people in pregnancy? No, not at all. It is only going to jeopardize the health of both the mother and the baby. For an average built woman, it is sufficient if you are eating 2000 to 2200 calories with an additional 300 healthy calories. Generally, your healthcare provider will calculate your expected weight gain in pregnancy depending on your body mass index and will help you with the diet chart to do the same. Now, myth number two, eating saffron causes a light skin colored baby? No, skin color is to do with genetics. This has nothing to do with the skin color of the baby. Now, myth number three, coffee is contraindicated in pregnancy. Coffee generally causes the absorption rate of the nutrients to be a little at the lesser side. So hence, we advocate to you ha only having one or two cups in maximum a day. Myth number four, eating papaya causes miscarriages. Not at all. Papaya, there is no documented evidence saying that papaya causes miscarriage. Now, the other myth, which is most commonly asked myth, is that having curd in pregnancy causes cold for the baby. No, not at all. Because curd, which is prepared well at home, only improves the probiotic levels and will help you in improving the immunity. Now, does citrus food cause any infections and cause uh, the uh, cold in pregnancy? No, not at all. Citrus foods will help you with improving the immunity and will especially help you in fighting infections in pregnancy. Thank you and have a great day.